Now, understandably, they're both shaken by this incident. He says that he was walking home after grabbing pizza for dinner when he was attacked, and part of that incident was caught on camera. It's devastating. You know, you don't really you don't think about this happening to to somebody so close to you just out of nowhere. Chrissy Costell and her fiance John Berardi are still coping after an attack that left him badly injured over the weekend. Around 11:15 on Saturday night, Berardi says that he was walking home after grabbing a pizza when he passed by three young men near the intersection of South Charles and Ford Avenue. They start asking me, "Hey, let me get some of that pizza." It's like, let well, me we just kind of ignore it and keep walking. Um, and then they turned around and started following me down the block. And now they're demanding the pizza. And they're, they're holding broomsticks or poles. Berardi says he gave over the pizza, and their surveillance video captures what happened next. And as I was walking away, uh, one of them stuck with me, and he just cracked me in the face with like a, a metal pole. Berardi says a group of people came out of a nearby home to help him. They called medics and Costal, then went to the hospital. They fractured my nose. Uh, you can see they split open my forehead. I have a hole in my retina. They don't know if that's going to heal on its own or not, and that's causing central vision loss in my right eye. Both say that this incident has really affected their sense of security and thinks more needs to be done. We're really trying to hold on to, to hope of any amount of recovery, um, but it's really scary and it's really, really challenging. I just don't think it's right that Someone can do this to somebody and like, you know, I've worked here for years. I've, I've lived here for years. I've paid my taxes. I've been an upstanding citizen of Baltimore and now I'm left with one less eye and a, a, a stack of medical bills. Now, Berardi told me that the thieves didn't take anything else other than the pizza. On top of that, he says that he will need several surgeries. He says that he doesn't understand why that group attacked him. Police say that they are investigating. Reporting live here in Fed Hill, Kyrie Stewart, WBAL TV 11 News.